Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it, Capricorn. All right, so let's see what's going on for you. It looks like somebody is a power struggle or power dynamic. Maybe has shifted. Maybe you were on top, the other person you know, was waiting for you and, you know, they were running after you and now it's the other way around or, or vice versa. I don't know. Let's see. Four of Wands. Things are going very well in the home sector. Okay. Um, you could be hanging out with a circle of girlfriends. It's just going really good. You're, you're enjoying life. You're in a very high self-esteem you know you're in a very high time in your life maybe the spring of your life things are taking shape forming for you especially if you're a feminine energy um you could be getting a lot of uh praise something big maybe you got a big contract some monumental thing happened for you this is good you could be celebrating you could want to take your friends and family, loved ones out, or just engage with them. Let's see. What's going on for Capricorn? Okay, yep, yeah, the Six of Swords. So um, you're making sense of moving on from things that just were hurtful, and it's not serving you to stay there. You didn't get what you wanted in some situation, but it's about just moving on from that. Um, and leading that that part of you that was you know um self-sabotaging leaving it behind so you can move forward yeah nine of pentacles so that you can um i don't know if this is like moving from being in a relationship to this is same sex to from same sex to maybe single or eligible bachelor somebody also could be coming out of a relationship because they were waiting so long for someone to make a choice to decide on them someone is making sense of moving on there could or just making sense of moving on from the issue because Somebody feels like something isn't over. They're just frustrated with the process and how long it's taken and how someone just won't make a move. But it looks like all of a sudden something springs back up from the past because this has historical reference. So you got to deal with something that you didn't deal with in the past. It's coming back up here in the tower. Sudden upheaval. All of a sudden, the world card. Somebody wants... I don't know. All of a sudden, maybe, let's see. What is the world? Because it could be anything. Yeah. I knew it. All of a sudden, somebody's like, look, I'm just going to walk away. Um, it's not working for me. I'm, I feel like I'm not going to get what I want. Somebody has done some self-analysis. They're like, I'm just going to walk off into the sunset. I don't know where this journey is taking me, but I'm ready and I'm willing to go on the journey here. And I don't know how long I'll be on the journey, but I got to get away from this because there is discontentment, boredom, dissatisfaction. Yeah, somebody is saying maybe there is something better on the horizon or in the horizon. Maybe I can have expansion, growth somewhere else, doing something else. This could even be leaving a job or you know or whatever this could be going from working in a group setting to maybe doing some independent work this is definitely creating something in a very creative phase in your life and some of you are thinking about going you know being pregnant motherhood yeah you're thinking about pregnancy and motherhood You're also thinking about someone else. Some of you think about pregnancy, motherhood. 
somebody's ready. A feminine energy is ready. The masculine energy is not. Not ready to be in a relationship. Not ready to give you what you want. Not ready to have a baby. Not ready. Not ready. I don't know. But somebody's not ready. Um, and then there's a person who is ready. Let's see what the oracle has to say for my Capricorn. All right. Yeah, it just costs too much. So it could be actually physical dollars or money. It costs too much to invest. It costs too much to do this or do that. Or someone is saying, I just don't, I don't want to invest my time, my energy, my devotion, my love. It costs too much. It costs too much to be in a relationship or, or whatnot. Uh, let's see. Yeah, a con man, a fraud, a liar, it's all cap. Yeah, some of you are leaving someone behind because they were taking too long to move forward. Someone could just be cheap as heck. They don't want to make any type of investment here. Whether it's money or it's time or it's energy. El Cheapo. You could be dealing with El Cheapo here. Um, and someone was just a liar. And that's why we got that energy of someone saying, I, I got to cut my losses. I spend any more time here. It'll just be wasted time. As if the time that I already spent here wasn't wasted. But if I spend any more time here than I... I actually know in my heart that it's wasted time. So there's an energy of someone saying, you know, I have to move on. And it leaves somebody in a in a funk, in a tizzy. They don't know what to do. Maybe they may even come to you wanting forgiveness, but they're very prideful, stubborn. And they're accepting the fact that you guys will be separated. They don't know how to come back to you, but it looks like eventually they will get some nudge, some push. This is what I have for you, Capricorn. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. You can also catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You could um, go over to the website, book there, book your own reading if any of this resonated with you. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. You can come learn the Tarot with me. Classes are linked below. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.